No, not right now, but I am getting married this summer. Congratulations. Thanks. How often do you actually Well, All right, good evening, my friends. No, not right now, but I am getting married this summer. Ah, so you're listening to English conversation and practicing. That's good. Let's see if we can share the screen. Okay, just remind me if this one was the last exercise. On, on last Thursday. Verdad que sí? Hello, hello. Hello, everybody. Was this the last exercise? Okay, this was the last exercise. Okay. We're going to start with a pronunciation exercise. This is a sentence stress. Now, I want you to listen to me, pay attention, and I, I want to ask you if you, if you see the, like the big balls in the sentences, you see the big balls? Like in, excuse me, they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Si la ven, las bolitas grandes? Yes. Okay, yeah. that, that is like where you have to raise your voice. Yeah, your voice goes up. Like that is rising intonation. A eso le vamos a llamar stress. Like similar to tilde in Spanish. Okay. And here we say, excuse me. Si yo colocar esa bolita, la fuerza de voz, al final se, se escucharía, excuse me. Notice the difference? Excuse me. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. You see what the, the stress makes in that pronunciation. Yep. Okay. I'm going to repeat again. Y luego lo van a hacer usted. All right. Excuse me. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay, Julio, you start. Very perfect. Todas, I todas. like the blue one. Uh -huh. They are not very attractive. 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 They're not they're not very attractive. They are not very attractive. Very good. Thank you, Sarah. Your turn. Excuse me, they're not perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay, thank you. Uh, Jennifer, Damisela. Excuse me, they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay, very good, thank you. Voy a hacer una pausa acá, okay. When you see a contraction, you have to say the contraction. Okay? Aquí dice there, ¿verdad? No dice they are. 
Got it? So pay attention to that. Blanca, your turn. Blanca, no se escucha. We can listen to you. Okay, okay. okay. Excuse me. They perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay, thank you. Vamos con Elba. Excuse, excuse me. Mm -hmm. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I like the blue one. All right. Thank you. Diana. Diana Stefan. Excuse me. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Pretty good pronunciation. Pretty good. Thank you. Okay, esto que está enfermita, ¿verdad? All right. Yeah. Adriana, it's your turn. Okay. Excuse me. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Very good. Thank you. Nice pronunciation. I want to see who this girl. No se ve. Melissa. It's your turn. Excuse me, they are perfect. I like it, they blue one. They are not very attractive. They're not very attractive. They're not very attractive. They're not very attractive. They're not, they, you have to find rhythm, okay? El inglés tiene ritmo e intonación. Eh? They're not very attractive. Vaya, vaya agarrando ya su estilo, okay? Agarrando su estilo. Good. All right. Thank you, Melissa. Sarah Elizabeth. Teacher. Yes. Continue. Uh, again. Excuse me. They're not. Per they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Okay. They're not very attractive. Yolanda Yamilet. Excuse me. They are attractive. They are perfect. There. I like the blue. I like the blue one. They are not very attractive. Your, your internet. Your internet. It's your internet. You have a problem with your internet. Josue Abel. No está. Jessica Elizabeth. Excuse me. They perfect. I like the blue one. They not very attractive. They're not very attractive. They're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. They -E -E -E. They're not. They're not. Very good. Very good. Jessica Elizabeth. <laughs> Jessica. Yo no sé. Yo acabo, yo acabo de hablar. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Es que se me desaparece <laughs> aquí del, 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 del cuadrito. Ah. Por eso yo dije yo que no, pero yo fui. Ay, disculpe, I'm sorry about that. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, Ana Cristina. Excuse me, they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. They're not very attractive. Okay, thank you. Juan Alberto. No, Juan Alberto. Hola, hola, hola. Okay, can you repeat this these phrases here? Excuse me. Uh -huh. They're perfect. I like blue one. They're not very attractive. All right, thank you. Vamos a ver con Liliana Abigail. 
excuse me, they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. Very good, excellent. Ana Elizabeth. Excuse me, they're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. All right, Ana y Leticia. No. Excuse me, they are perfect. I like the one. They're very attractive. Wow, you have problem with your internet. But we listen that you are, you are practicing, okay? Okay, my friend, thank you. That was a warm up. Ya calentamos. Now we have a conversation, okay? This exercise is different. Let's check what is, what is this about. And it says, can I help you? Put items for sale on your desk or table, notebooks, watches, or bags. Okay, in this case, I have my headphones. Okay, one of you is gonna be a clerk and the other are the customer. What's the clerk? Is the salesperson in, in the store. Okay, así que va a comenzar el clerk. Okay, if we didn't eat. A student B is the customer. As about the price of each item, say if you want to buy it. Okay. Veamos el ejemplo. ¿Cómo dice? Can I help you? Yes. I like these sunglasses. How much are they? Which ones? Oh, okay, teacher. Pero estamos hablando de varios. Okay, this is plural. And when it's, when it's singular, that is, this is the example. Pay attention. Can I help you? Yes. I like this watch. How much is it? Which one? See the difference? When it's one, I ask how much is it? When it, when are like two or more, how much are they? Understand? Understand, understand the activity. Vamos a ver. Okay, veo a Melissa, Diana, y veo, there's a TV above her, on her, on the, on the wall, yeah, there's a TV. Le vamos a comprar ese TV a, a Melissa, ¿ok? Melissa comienza y me dice, can I help you? Yes. I like that TV. How much is it? Y ella me va a decir, which one? Oh, the big one. Hay, digamos que ahí hubieran tres TVs, pero yo quiero el más grande, ¿verdad? Yo digo, the big one. How much, how much does it cost? Or what's the price? Ahí puedo usar yo cuánto vale, ¿verdad? Y ahí me dice, oh, $300. Or $400. Así vamos a jugar, ¿ok? Sí. What objects can we use? We can use a notebook. We can use a watch. We can use rings. We can use your glasses, etc. Understand the activity? Yes or no? No. No? Vamos a hacer una conversación similar a la que está ahí. Solamente que le vamos a cambiar la, los objetos, me imagino. Correcto, correcto. Ok. Con las cositas que tengan a la mano. Yo veo que Melissa tiene una puerta, puede vender la puerta, el TV. Ahí veo una cortina, vendan. Ok, ahí veo un watch. Que tenemos que cambiar todo, tita. Solo el objeto. Solo eso. Sí. La otra respuesta, no. 
si es una cosa, diga how much is it? Para, por el precio. Si son varias, okay. el que está aquí, how much are they? Ah, okay. ¿Y la respuesta? Ajá, esa. Y aquí dice, which one? Ahí, cuando le pregunte, which one? Ah, the black one. Si es, si es negro, ¿verdad? Diga the black one. Sí. Si es uh, verde, the green one. Ok. Let's go.
Okay. Vocabulary. Materials. What are these things made of? Do you understand the question? <laughs> ¿De qué está hecho? Okay, ¿de qué están hechas? Estas cosas, ¿verdad? We have like many things there. Identify each one. Use the word from the list. Let's check the list. We have cotton. What is cotton? Algodón. Yes. Robert? Yes. Robert. The car? Rubber? Caucho. Caucho. Mm -hmm. Ule, coma, ule. Gold? Oro. Yeah. Oro. Silk? Seda. Seda. Leather? Cuero. Cuero. O, o piel, ¿verdad? Piel. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Cuero. Piel. Silver? Acero. O hierro. No, silver. Plata. 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 Plastic. Plástico. Plástico. Wool. Lana. Lana. ¿Sube o baja? No se escucha, Ticho. Lana, lana sube o lana baja. No fueron a Kinder, ¿no? <laughs> Ni yo tampoco. All right. Me uh, perdí. This. <laughs> yo sé. This is English. That's why. Okay. A plastic bracelet. That's the example. A gold, gold. A gold ring. Vamos tomando. Take note. Take note. A gold ring. Um, number three. Gold, gold. No, no, no. Number three. Seal. Uh, a seal. A seal tie. A seal tie. Tie. Uh, Number four. A gold sock. Mm, vamos a aprovechar esta oportunidad porque cuando yo digo socks, estoy hablando de plural. ¿Verdad? Sí. Entonces no puedo usar un artículo indefinido. Porque los artículos indefinidos son para singular. O sea, a plastic bracelet, a ring, a silk tie es uno. ¿okay? Si usted dice a sax, es un gran chejain. Ok, Está, estaría diciendo un calcetines. Ok, be careful. Number five. A uh, leather. Yes, a leather jacket. Jacket. Six. A current shirt. Very good. Seven. A silver carry. Earrings. Silver, si, silver earrings. Eight. eight. A rubber pot. Pero Cuidado si con el A. a. Cuidado con el A. Rubber pot. Rubber boots. Finch. Rubber yeah. Rubber boots. Everybody okay? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Entonces en plural no lleva la haya. No. Ni an. No. Ok. Ok. 
now we have another activity. We have a conversation. Now listen. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one, why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me. How much is this jacket? It's 499. Would you like to try it on? Oh, no. That's okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. Questions? Pronunciation? Pronunciation. Are you okay? Veamos si está. Yes, it... Okay, vamos a responder. Vamos a practicar con Sara. Sara, one line each, okay? No importa si de repente sale algo más. Don't worry. One line each, okay? I start. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one, why? It's look, it looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me. How much is this jacket? It's... For under ninety, well, would you like to try it? Try it on. Oh, uh, no, that's okay. But thanks anyway. You're welcome. Very good. Thank you, Sarah. Blanca, you wanna practice? Okay. Por supuesto okay. que por supuesto que yes, va a decir. Okay, you start. Okay. Look at. Yakes are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one? Which? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the gold one. Um, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's four hundred ninety nine. Would you like to try it on? Mm, no, thanks. Okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. Thank you, Blanca. Okay, okay, now let's go to the to the groups and practice, please.
Okay. Let's talk about grammar. You have preferences and comparison with adjectives. The first two questions are used to uh, ask about what do you select? What do you choose? What do you prefer? Y tenemos acá que dice, which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Okay, so which one? Well, you have two things. Yeah? Do you prefer this one or this one? Oh, I prefer the leather one. Yeah? Another way to ask about preferences is which one do you like? Which one do you like better? Or which one do you like more? You can use either one and it's gonna be okay. But if, if people ask with better, you're going to answer with better. If people ask with more, you answer with more. Veamos. Which one do you like better? Oh, I like the leather one better. Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. You see? That, that has to correspond to the question. Any comments? Okay, comprende mucho. Pero todavía me confundo un poquito. ¿Cuál es la pregunta? Eh, ¿Dónde se utiliza better and more? Son opcionales. Usted puede usar las tres, cualquiera de las tres preguntas. Puede usar, which one do you prefer? Which one do you like better? Or which one do you like more? Las tres van en el mismo sentido. ¿Qué prefieres? Sí. Lo ¿Sí? O sea, para preguntar, ¿Qué prefieres? ¿O cuál prefieres? Like more o like better. Ya. Yeah. Okay, let's talk about the other column. We're going to talk about comparison with adjectives. Ya teníamos algo acá. Like we have short adjectives. Veamos cuáles son los short adjectives que tenemos acá. Tenemos cheap, nice, pretty, and big. Cheap pasa cheaper, nice, nicer, pretty, prettier. Agregamos un short, shorter, no está ahí, ¿verdad? Big, bigger. And the word then. Vamos a usar then para introducir el otro objeto con el que estamos comparando. We're going to use then to introduce the other object or to add the other object that we are comparing with. En el caso, the first example says, that one is cheaper than the wool one. Estoy comparando esta con aquella, right? Or oh, this one is nicer than, y la otra cosa, ¿verdad? Oh, teacher, pero yo veo que aquí tiene short adjective. Yeah, short adjective because they have only one syllable. Mire, cheap. Cheaper. Nice. Nicer. Pretty. Prettier. Short. Shorter. Heavy. Heavier. Got it? Ahora tenemos long adjectives. In long adjectives... Vamos a usar, we're going to use the word more or less. ¿Ya? Yeah? More or less. More convenient or less convenient. 
Por eso tenemos aquí more stylish or lesser stylish. We can use another word, like another long adjective can be expensive. Expensive. Can be more or less expensive. Got it? Need it? More expensive or less expensive? ¿Cuándo uso more or less? Question? Question. More or less is cantidades. ¿Cuándo es más, cuándo es menos? No. Cuando no es comparativo. No. Continue, continue. Aquí no hay respuestas malas. Luego corregimos. ¿Cuándo es muy caro? Excuse me. El precio se llama caro, más barato. No. Quack. Tiempo. Más por cantidades. Voy a usar more or less porque es un adjetivo largo. Con los adjetivos largos no voy a ocupar er. Uso er con los adjetivos cortos. Sí, mira, cheap, cheaper, nice, nicer, pretty, prettier, short, shorter, heavy, heavier. Adjetivos cortos. Adjetivos largos. Long adjectives uso more or less para darle sentido positivo o negativo. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo. Price more is more convenient than selectos. Ya no estamos comprando los supermercados. ¿Right? Price Mart is more convenient than Super Selectos. Got it? No. Y lo uso para comparar, ¿verdad? ¿Qué quiere decir? These tennis are less expensive than The, those ones. Then the black ones. Cuando digo less expensive, son menos caros. Más baratos, pues. No digo less expensive. Yo digo more expensive, más caros. ¿Qué? ¿Ok? ¿Comprende mucho o comprende poquito? Better. Okay. Now, I want you to work on this exercise. Please use the adjectives. Which dress is prettier? Prettier. Yes. Prettier. Prettier. Yeah, it's okay. Well, the green one is silk, and silk is more expensive. Ah, more expensive than? 
polyester. polyester. Is this blue t-shirt less large, the red and white one? Okay, van allá anotando. Okay, ¿cómo dijo? More large. Large. Less, less. Less, no. El large no es un adjetivo largo. Larger. larger. Ah, larger. Ah, larger, sí, está bien. No, the red and white one is bigger. It's a medium. The blue one is a more small. Bueno, háganlo ahí y vamos a revisar. Okay, number one, which dress is prettier, prettier, the yellow, the yellow one or the green one? The green one is silk and silk is expensive than polyester. Pero le hace falta una palabra ahí. More expensive than. Ah, more expensive than polyester. Why? Because we are comparing two, two materials. More expensive than. Okay. Number two. If this blue teacher, uh -huh. larger, larger, yes, larger, larger the larger the, than the red, the red and white, and white one, and white one. No, the red and white is bigger. Than. Bigger, no, ahí solo sería bigger. bigger. It's bigger. It's a medium. The blue one is a small. Okay. Uh, pens. Look at these pens. Which one do you like? Better. 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 I prefer the cotton ones. They're more stylish than. Okay. More stylish. Stylish than. Than the wool ones. Better. Better. Okay. 
Yes, Juan Alberto. Este, ahí van cambiando por el presente simple. En las, cuando le cambiamos el, el large, larger. No, es que esos son adjetivos comparativos. Por eso cambian. Sí, por eso cambian, cuando vamos a comparar. Adjetivos comparativos. Son adjetivos comparativos, en la lámina anterior ahí decía, ¿verdad? Miren. Preferences, comparison with adjective. Comparison, ok, comparative adjective, aquí estamos. Ok. Ok, if there are no more questions. Ya no tenemos más tiempo. I'm sorry. Bueno, eh, aprovechamos y vamos a hablar en español. Este, felicitarlos por el avance que van teniendo en la plataforma. La mayoría está al día. Y algunos me, me han comentado que ya terminaron la plataforma. Claro, son pocos, ¿verdad? Los que la han terminado. Otros se van al día. Y un, un muy poca parte de ustedes se ha atrasado. Pero no es algo que es un retraso eh, significativo. Eso lo pueden lograr pronto. Recuerde que en la plataforma usted puede eh, dar muchos intentos hasta lograr que ese ejercicio le quede bien. All right, my friends. We're going to call the attendance. And we call Adriana Eugenia, la Gra Grajeda. Present. Present. Thank you. Ana Cristina Osorio. Present. Thank you. Ana y Leticia García. Ana Elizabeth Campos. Present teacher. Ana Mirtala Guzmán. No. Blanca Esmeralda Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you. Cynthia Marisol Mejía. Cristian Ernesto Romero. Present teacher. Thank you. Diana Stephanie Salmerón. Here. Diego Francisco Aguilera. Elba Milagro Granados. Present. Thank you. Fátima Saraí Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Jessica Elizabeth Romero. Present teacher. Thank you. Josué Abel Luna. Um, Josué Abel. Ah, no, ya estuvo. Juan Alberto Fuentes. Present teacher. Juan Carlos López. Thank you. Present. Julio César Tobar. Present teacher. Thank you. Liliana Abigail Cedillo. Present teacher. Melissa Daniela Ángel. Present. Thank you. Miguel Alejandro Rodríguez. Present teacher. Thank you. Natalia Irene Milian. Roberto Carlos Pineda. Present. Thank you. Sara Elizabeth López. I'm here. Thank you. Sidna Eunice Ruiz. Present teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Damisela Flores. I'm here. 
Thank you. And Yolanda Yanilet Andrade de, de Rodas. Okay. All right, my friends. We are over. And we say goodbye. Okay, study and see you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Good night. Goodbye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night.